Hi folks, another uh, good question from our adult training uh, list was from Kira, and Kira is planning to go skiing in December, so something to look forward to Kira, fair play. Um, but like a lot of people, um, she's a small bit concerned uh, about her knee and how her knee would hold up on, you know, obviously the, the physical challenge that is that is skiing, um, not something you do every day in Ireland. So um, Kira's question is, what should I do and not do before this trip that will help me build the knee up and obviously, you know, prevent or reduce the chances of me getting injured. Um, well, Kira, I, I, I can sort of totally relate to you and how you might feel about that. I, I've done my cruciate twice in that right knee um, and I would have gone skiing before and after. Um, and not now in four or five years since kids and all that, but um, if I was to go skiing and if I was to uh, plan myself, I would do a, a well-structured and um, progressive kind of development program that brought me from basic bodyweight exercises with you know no no speed or no or, or you know very controlled and very static and very I know it's going to happen all the way up to you know worst case scenario high intensity plyometric you know jumping and landing and um, having to react when you when you're not sure sort of sure what's going to happen because i suppose when, when you're on a set of skis going down a hill at whatever speed you go down the hill at your body just sort of goes into automatic pilot and it has to be you know it has to have the physical competence and the ability to you know react to whatever happens whether it's going around someone or dodging someone or taking a tight corner um, and obviously most importantly your knees need to be ready for all of that but probably what people don't know, uh, or it's not sort of obvious, is it's not so much your knees are the are the issue. It's more all the muscles around your hips and your core that actually do a lot of work to uh, either control or support or help, uh, you know, protect your knees or not. So a lot of times knee injuries might occur, and I know from my end of things my uh you know my hips and my core this is where i got into this game in the first place i wasn't as sort of developed and i wasn't as fit as as competent as, as i should have been and as a result uh my knees just weren't as protected by the rest of my body as they should have been so what you what you need to do is you need to really uh you need to develop that as much as possible um and you really need to you need to try and, and, and move and practice moving and practice landing and practice jumping and practice changing direction and doing it slowly first and then going up and, and doing it you know more quickly and with with greater um, with greater I've lost my train of thought there um, with greater <laughs>